So one thing I've been wanting to do with these videos is to have us become more present in the moment at the beginning of all the videos I do. So right now, let's take a deep breath together and we're gonna take a deep breath and we're gonna feel the sensations inside of our body. Now the reason we're doing this is because what it does is it brings the awareness and it brings it into our body so that we're actually able to embody the present moment at a deeper level so that whatever ideas I share with you today, we're able to absorb more of them. We're able to see them in a little bit different way because we're in the moment and we're more present. So let's do that right now. So just breathe in with me. And then take a deep breath out and then feel the sensation in your hands, feel the sensation in your feet, feel the sensation throughout your whole body. Now as I speak, feel the stillness in between even the words that I say, feel the stillness underneath everything that you're doing right now and become more present with what you're paying attention to. Now attention is the idea behind this video today. And what I'll be speaking about with attention is how powerful your attention is. There's something about your attention that is so powerful that there are companies that will pay millions of dollars just to get 30 seconds of your attention with the hopes that they can prime your brain or they can have some type of influence on the decisions that you make, whether it's going to the grocery store, for example, and then buying uh, Charmin Ultra because everyone knows less is more. The idea is that when you see certain things, whether it's on advertising, marketing, on billboards, whatever it is, what it's doing is it's making that recognition in your brain and it's making it more likely that that will grow. Now understand that wherever your attention goes is where your energy is going. So when you become more aware of that, when you become more aware of what you're thinking and how you're feeling in the moment, what you can then begin to do is put your attention where you want to go. Put attention on things that actually build what you want to do rather than paying attention to things that build someone else's dream. So when you look at and you're watching advertisements on TV, for example, you're building their ideas because your attention, which is so powerful, is going and building those ideas. So what I encourage you to do is to first off understand how powerful your attention is and that if you choose to focus and become more aware of where your attention is, you can profoundly change your life. Now, how do we build our attention? Well, the first thing that we need to realize is that our, our attention span is a muscle. That the more that we pay attention to certain things, the easier it's going to be for us to build that. Now, how does this work? Well, from a... Uh, like a neuroscience point of view, the idea is that our RAS, or what we could fundamentally call our reticular activating system, which is just a long technical name for it, but there's a part of our brain that uses and that sees value in whatever we're paying attention to. Now, if we are paying attention to something that we believe has value, what happens is, is our brain lights up. It's one of the reasons why when we go to work, sometimes we're driving, we may not even be paying attention to what we're doing on our way to work. We may hardly remember our drive to work at the end of the day because our RAS shuts off and the automatic uh, part of us is just going on automatic. So the idea is that our RAS lights up when we pay more attention and we have more value in the things that we're doing. So the idea is to pay attention and to give value to doing things that create something good for you in your life. Now this could be simply uh, books that give you some type of new ideas or that help grow whatever you're passionate about in life. The more that you do that and you consciously become aware, then the more action you take by reading those books, by creating whatever you want in your life, the more you're going to be building your attention. Now something else that I do when I am uh, knowing about building a, my attention span is what I do is I don't watch commercials. So when, if you're watching television, I don't watch much television, but sometimes I do. I watch like Shark Tank or something like that very uh, rarely, but I do it sometimes. When I do it, I mute the TV and I don't pay attention to it when the commercials are on because I choose in that time to put my attention on 
something else, even if it's just for three or four minutes, because I understand how powerful and how much I would rather my attention go towards other things to grow ideas that I'm more passionate about. So one other thing you could do is to simply not pay attention to the commercials that come on, to mute the television for example, and the more that we do that, the more that we're actually saying yes to our attention going to something that we actually want to build. Now, another part of also understanding more about our attention span is understanding that there are certain activities that build our attention. One of those is meditation. I've talked about it before, but out of the idea of attention, one thing that I used to have is ADHD. And I had that all growing up. I took Adderall in high school for it. I took Adderall all up until about four years ago. And what I did was I simply decided to try activities that would bring me naturally into that feeling of having stronger attention. And because of that, I've actually been able to develop it naturally. So one thing that I do every day is I meditate. For 20 minutes right when I wake up, I focus on my breath, just like we did in the beginning of this video, put your sense perceptions inside your body, feel into it, focus on your breath and pay attention to that and what you're going to begin to see is that you develop a new level of attention where it becomes easier for you to focus on certain things and you're then going to be truly building your attention span. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. If you've uh, watched it this long, then obviously there's some type of attention span going on so I applaud you for that. Feel free to like and subscribe below. And other than that, hope you guys have a great day today. Much love. Bye.